Hey everyone, my name is Scott. I run a little website called Mixer.com and today I'm going to tell you all about my GoPro chest mount harness. For those that don't know, this is the chest mount that you're going to need if you want some killer POV style action on your bike or from your bike. I've been using this one for several years now and it has not let me down. It's a little bit expensive, yes, but I'll get into that in a moment. But the bottom line is that it's totally worth it. And if I can do this while going up a hill, that's extra awesome. Oh, there we go. That's actually hard to do. I'm out of breath. I can't think. But now we're going downhill, which is good. Anyway, the entire purpose of this video is to tell you all about this thing. All of its good points, all of its bad points. It's mostly good, to be honest. Uh, I know that a lot of people give it crap because it's a little bit more expensive than the other chest mount systems on the market, but trust me, it's totally worth it. I'm gonna tell you why. If I can just find a nice, quiet spot. Okay, so the best way to do this, I think, is to tell you all about the pros and cons of this thing. And I'm gonna start off with the bad things first because, well, that's not fun to talk about, so we're just gonna get it right out of the way. Anyway, the con, of course, is that it is expensive, or more expensive than some of the other chest mount systems that you'll find. Uh, is it worth it? Uh, yeah, I'll get to that in a moment, but it definitely is. But uh, price is definitely a consideration. If you're looking to save a few bucks, maybe this isn't the one for you, but don't worry about that. I do have some alternative choices, which I'll tell you all about at the end of this video. But uh, in terms of the cons, that's pretty much all I can think of. I mean, it's, it's, it's overall very good. I've got a lot of good things to say about it and uh, not so much bad. So let's not dwell on the negative and keep on going. Onto the good stuff. So we're gonna start talking about the pros now. And I've gotta say that the biggest thing that I like about this GoPro official chest mount harness, whatever you wanna call it, is its durability. I've had this thing for three years. I have worn it through many kinds of situations. I've crashed with it. I've been dragged down dirt hills with it. I've crashed on pavement. Uh, it's a little bit scuffed up in areas, but it has held firm through all of that. And that is my number one reason why I like this thing. It's definitely a pro, it's a solid pro. And remember, you get what you pay for. You spend a few extra bucks, you're gonna get a quality item and this official GoPro chest mount harness. That's so hard to say, but it's definitely strong. It's gonna take what you can give it and uh, yeah. Another thing that I really like about this chest mount harness, it is highly, highly adjustable. You've got adjustments here on the front. You can pull it tight or loose up here on the corners. And even in the back, it's completely adjustable and you're gonna find a fit that works well for you. Now, keep in mind that I wear this with all types of jerseys. Here, this is my summer jersey. It's very light and thin, so I can strap it down really tight. And I've also got a winter jersey, which is really thick. I know this is San Diego, it doesn't get very cold, but I do wear winter jerseys here in San Diego in the winter time. But anyway, this harness works for that because I can just loosen up the straps and uh, it holds firm and it doesn't move the camera, so that is definitely a plus. Something else I really like, if you can see me through all the shaking around and riding on the grass, <laughs> I like the POV style videos that I can get while wearing the GoPro chest mount harness. Now, I'll include some samples here of what I'm talking about, but it doesn't take much to get a really good video wearing this thing. Just strap your camera on, as you can see, and don't worry so much about getting the angle right. Just make sure you point it up so you're not recording the ground. That's a common mistake that most people make when they first wear one of these things. But you point it up, don't worry about getting the horizon level or any of that jazz. You can fix all that in post-production and the videos look amazing. You're gonna look like a professional videographer, an amazing bike rider, all that good stuff. It's amazing. I love this thing. And finally, the last thing that I want to mention about this GoPro chest mount harness is that, don't worry, it is indeed lightweight and comfortable. I know it looks a little bit obtrusive going around the shoulders and the back like that, but 
Actually, to be honest, I don't even notice it. Even when breathing really hard and working really hard on the bike, climbing hills and whatnot, uh, it just feels like a like a seat belt, like a like a light seat belt. I don't have it really tight. I can get my fingers under here. I can stretch it. So it's not really clamped to me. I can breathe fine. It's no issues at all. And like I said, I mean, I don't even notice it when I'm riding. So it's definitely, it's. I, I was definitely worried about that before I got it. But uh, if you're concerned about that, don't be. Anyway, that's all I've got. Uh, the bottom line is, of course, you do need to get one of these things if you're uh, if you're on the fence about it. It's totally worth it, at least for the the kinds of videos that you'll be able to get. Uh, it's it's amazing. You know, I'm far from being the most amazing videographer, but it totally took my my bike video game up a notch after getting this thing. So, also down in the description below, you will find a list of alternatives which I consider to be almost as good as this GoPro chest mount. There's a link to the actual chest mount that I'm using here in the description below. But there are also some alternatives for a slightly cheaper price. They're not quite as good as this, but uh, I know a lot of people are price conscious. I am too, I get it. But uh, definitely, if you can, spring for the original. This is amazing, it's been really good for me. I can't say enough good things about it. It's not a sponsored video just like sharing what I like. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.